What's up, Gooners? It's your favorite Grim Reaper, Destroy Heisei, and today we're going to be talking about Colin. Now, if you can't tell, I'm quite tired because I just woke up, and this is a take two of this video because I did a first take and I realized, what the fuck am I talking about? I don't know why I'm speaking logical to a bunch of fucking idiots. I'm going to make my point clear. Arachnid is not a pedophile. Literally, no one's sitting here calling anybody a pedophile over fucking niggas drawing Raven getting fucked by Beast Boy. Nobody gives a flying fuck. You want to know why? They don't fucking exist, and it's as harmless as you could fucking get. But Colin and his retard troop can't really tell the difference between this and fucking this. Because when the quarter Law talks about lolly and cartoon porn, they're talking about the latter picture that I showed. Whoa, big shocker, dude. It's kind of like they look like little fucking kids. And you know, not like busty, thick fucking women, because last time I checked, a 13 year old can't look like this. But let's start cherry picking some clips. From this video that I mentioned earlier that I said you all should watch, because I bet you 100% this is non biased from a sane person and has facts and studies to show that his point is fucking right. Okay, gang, let's say you're in a scenario where you happen upon three. Uh, th let's say three, and what's this guy? Three point three five pedophiles, and you're wondering how am I going to report this to the authority as a fraction? Yep, seems like a non-biased and same person to me. I would trust him diagnosing me with pedophilia. It's clear as day that the motherfucker is biased as hell. And look, obviously nobody likes fucking pedophiles, but a professional things to do is let the professionals handle it. He is not a fucking professional. This is his sources. How to draw anime if you have a mental illness and the fucking law. And the best source this dude had was a study showing that watching porn can lead to sexual aggression. And from the screenshot, you could clearly see they said nothing about lollies in the fucking study. Because all it's saying is the consumption of porn can lead to sexual aggression. So watching lolly porn could just lead you to fucking sexually harassing an adult woman. Which don't do that, by the way, because that's not fucking good. But the point is, it has nothing to do with fucking lollycons equals I want to fuck kids. And then this fucking idiot says, well, shooting in video games is not the same as lollycon because lollycon gives you a dopamine in your head that makes you want to fuck kids IRL or something. Now, was it said exactly like that? Fuck no, obviously. But was there any source to back up his claim? Fuck no, obviously. Because just like how when you're playing COD and you kill somebody, you could tell the difference between shooting an NPC and shooting a real life human. These people when they're watching lollies can tell the difference between a cartoon character and a real life fucking human. And if you can't tell the difference for both of those scenarios, you're cooked, brother. And then he went on about how fantasies can lead you to do real life things, which is no sources to that, by the way. And when I looked it up on Google, most of the studies, which aren't really too much of studies, I mean, they have some research, I guess, so that most people don't act on their fucking fantasies because it's too much of a fucking waste. And there's so much bullshit that goes with doing this shit IRL. Like I have fantasies of wanting to be an anime whore that fucks every guy and cuckles some dude. Do I want to fucking do that IRL? No, because I'd have to be trans. I'd have to go to a fucking surgery that could literally fucking kill me. And then I'd have to have sex with multiple men that would probably give me a fucking STD. Nobody wants to fucking do that. Obviously not. Case in point, this nigga's fucking stupid. And what's crazy is bro got ratio to his pinned comment. And the comment was basically just saying how the age of consent in Japan being 13 is some bullshit. And the youngest that the age of consent is in most prefectures is 16. And it's true. The youngest it is in most prefectures is 16. It's only like 13 in some like random fucking places where they probably shoot each other with arrows. I don't believe that fucking happened in Japan. Please don't fucking kill me. And the only way you could legally get away with fucking somebody under the age of 16 is well if the parents fucking give you consent to do it. So basically you have to get sold off to the Zenin clan. Hey guy, I didn't mean to sell my kid. I just kind of needed 20 bucks. If you want to learn about the pedophilic disorder from an actual trained professional, watch this video right here. She has more videos on her channel talking about pedophilias and other mental health issues. If you want to go watch them, do it with your own free discretion. She also has like travel videos on there. I guess I'll add that too. The evidence that you originally provided in the beginning of that call was a statement from an article that didn't even show links to any studies and is from 12 years ago. And the funniest thing is, in that article, they even say that these things are still pedophilic. And they also didn't even spell pedophilia right. I don't think I got to go on a long tangent. Pedophilia spelled correct. It's an alternative spelling. Even in the first definition of pedophile, the one you love to use, if you click show more, it's spelled the exact same way. You are a dumbass. But he also keeps saying, oh, psychologists agree with my stupid arguments based on their illogical studies. Okay, Arachnid, what is the definition of a pedophile? A person who is sexually attracted to children. What is the definition of CP? Any visual depiction of a minor, a person who has not reached the age of consent, engaging in sexual explicit activity. You are a YouTuber that bases your whole theme around Spider-Man. You are not a psychologist. You cannot deem something illogical just because you don't like it. If you ever decide to go against any psychologist, you will literally get embarrassed. You have no evidence, no studies. You don't even know what the fuck you're fully talking about. You want to have a debate with me, but in the website you decided to choose, the definition of child porn would legitimately have nothing to do with arachnid because you yourself read out loud 
that a definition of child porn is any minor, anybody under the age of consent, being depicted sexually. Let me replay it just for all of us to see. What is the definition of CP? Any visual depiction of a minor, a person who has not reached the age of consent. What makes it worse, you continue reading and then say the age of consent in some states in the United States is 16 to 18. The age of consent, the age at which most people become legally capable of consenting to sexual relations, varies widely between countries, though in most countries, including the US, it is set between 16 and 18 years old. In the beginning of the video, you speak about Jenny the robot from My Life as a Teenage Robot, who is 16 years old. In your server, you speak of Gwen Stacy from Across the Spider-Verse, who is 16 to 17 years old. What is the age of consent in Michigan? Oh, 16 years old. And by that website's definition of child porn, if he did not age up the characters, it would be completely fucking fine. But even in your own website, it says if both parties are adults, then it's actually protected under the First Amendment. The only way that it's not is if the artist scene is obscene. And there is no defined age for a character. It's just a fucking character. You know what does have a defined age though? Human beings. But this is just to show you how dumb Colin is. The nigga's not even looking at the websites he's using, and he's using only one source, the first one he sees. And you think I'm joking too. No, look up what is child porn, and this is the first website that'll pop up. And they love to talk about a legal loophole. Well, here's three court cases where people have faced punishment for virtual child porn. So, no excuse now. So if it is child porn, he should be arrested. That simple. And I forget that some of you guys are children, so I have to remind you every five seconds that I find Lollicon weird. I also find a lot of porn weird. I find talking about porn weird. You know why? Because it's weird. You don't just go outside and start saying, oh my God, I love big booty Latinas, guys. Everybody, I love big booty Latinas. I love fucking big booty Latinas because it's fucking weird. I've looked at parts of the folder that Arachnid's friends sent to SK and Liam, and a lot of the things sent are from Japanese studies, which I already outlined as a problem earlier, and there are also other studies mixed in with this. And a good amount of these are long as shit, and I am not reading them. But you want to know why I'm not reading them? Because I do not need to. Yeah, I'm not having a debate with you, my nigga. Not only are you a fucking idiot, but you're insufferable, and you don't even know what the fuck you're talking about half the time. Nigga, this argument is literally, I have clairvoyance. If it is common sense, you should be able to show fact behind it. It is that fucking simple. It is common sense that strawberries are fucking red. You know why? Because if I search up a fucking strawberry right now, it is going to be red. But when I look up fucking lollicon pedophiles, I don't see no convicted people. No studies from psychologists showing a growth in lollicons and pedophilia. Cartoons and pedophilia. Cartoons and pedophiles. Why the fuck are there no studies if it's common sense? Knowing the difference between cartoons and fucking real life. That right there seems like common sense to me. God forbid somebody's fucking weird. Oh, I have to do everything in my power to make sure that he looks evil as possible. By calling him a pedophile, calling these cartoon characters minors without specifically saying they're cartoon characters, and expecting everybody to go off what you fucking say, because in your fucking terms, him animating CP is just cartoon characters that he liked, that he aged up. So fucking what? They're aged up. What do you want him to draw them as fucking kids? Like you're trying your best to push a narrative that he likes kids when he really doesn't. And you look dumb. And then you get mad that I don't want to debate you the very first second I fucking hop in a Discord server. Like Jesus Christ, what are you a child? I got to dangle a key over your fucking head every five seconds. And then he wants to make a community note with a Google Drive showing the screenshots of what was going on in the Discord server. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Seven screenshots. But let me just show you the funny representation of what happened in the server. Well, my video's done. I finished uploading. Now it's time to work on a pipe bomb. What the fuck? A leafy boy junior. Since you want to act all smug in your video and think you're proving anything, why don't you hop in a VC and discuss this either by privately or publicly? Since, as you say, you're so hungry for views. <laughs> I must have got to his head. That feels nice. Well, at least I should reply. Laughing my ass off. I must have pulled something, Colin. Why would I go in a VC with someone that tries to protect cartoon kids like they're real people? Look, if you really want to debate, then sure. You must really think I'm an idiot if I'm going to fall for something like that. Oh well, back to making my pipe bump. What the hell? These are a lot of comments. Oh shit, they're baking his ass. And he's getting ratioed. You know what? Fine. I'll entertain him a little bit. So yeah, I guess I watched Milan get fucked. I'm a cuckold. Miles, what the fuck are you talking about, man? To be honest, I have no idea. I was thinking- Yo, Spidey, who the fuck is that? Alright, I'll agree to your stupid debate on one condition. Arachnid has to mean the VC too. Ha! <laughs> okay, well, good luck in his sorry ass here. Let's get this nigga- Hey, yo, chill on that one, nigga, like, what the fuck? Okay, well, what's that nigga's Discord? Oh, uh, y'all niggas saying that shit too smoothly, bruh. Anyway, Colin, if that nigga gets Arachnid in here, don't that mean he's not alone no more? Oh, shit, you right, man. I, I mean, my bro? Yo, bitch, I don't know and I don't give a fuck. It's your argument. You should be able to back it up. I know that. That's why I need the Gooner, dummy. Your claim is that Aratnik Gooner is a pedophile because he likes cartoon characters that are minors, right? 
you're also claiming that he also likes lollies. Who else is gonna know if this gooner likes lollies other than the gooner himself? Well, fuck, this bitch is not a dumbass. Oh well, I try to distract him with stupidity. You realize that he could just lie, right? Why are you holding a grudge over something that isn't even low key beef? It's just you getting butthurt over me calling you a troll. What the fuck does him saying I don't like real children have to do with anything? That was no way to an argument. For real, my nigga, that makes no damn sense. I said I wanted him to say if he likes lollies, not real children. Can you please read? Yo, arguing with Spidey's kind of nuts, dog. He would say no to liking real children. And it's irrelevant because he could obviously lie. Can you read? My nigga, you better watch he say, little bro. Spidey got powers, man. We literally have proof of this dude animating CP. What is up a child in real life? Lollies? Something that I or anyone would look at and think, damn, this is a serious legal offense? Or was it what you posted on Twitter? My nigga, what? How fucking stupid are you? Hey, yo, you got no proof of that. Hey, yo, Colin, what the fuck is this, man? Bro, what the fuck? My nigga, you're bugging out with this one, I'm not gonna lie. Chill, Miles, we just gotta keep pushing, bro. I mean, it's still gross. Yo, my nigga, who the fuck is this? I'm Mew from like a whole different world, but like we got the same voice. Cause I see doesn't have the AI for Miles Morales into the Spidey verse. My nigga, what? Whatever, my nigga. I still agree though. I mean, it is gross and weird. I mean, you're still sexualizing your child. And why are you doing it, nigga? Gross ass motherfucker. We have proof that the niggas attracted to things depicting children and defend it. Like you. Oh? And why do you find it gross and weird? Is Dash trying to defend Arachnid? Well, being gross and weird is one thing, but being a pedophile is another thing. Answer my question. Well, if there's a difference, then I guess you're a pedophile, my nigga. Dumbass, what? How's there a difference between being weird and being a pedophile? Well, the reason why I find it weird is because I don't like cartoon drawings of children. Drawn as children. Simply put, not my thing. You do, my nigga. Don't lie. Holy fucking shit. So you just debunked your own argument. I'm about to kick your ass to Saturn. What the hell are you even talking about, my nigga? But yeah, I say, you're honestly going to hell. Look, I think you get the point now. The Discord is just a bunch of bullshitting and insulting. If you ever think you're gonna go in there changing your mind, trying to debate them, don't do it. You're a fucking idiot. You're not gonna change your mind. I'm gonna put all the screenshots of what actually happened in a Google Drive and then link it down in the description so you can read it all. It's fucking 35 screenshots, dog. I'm not doing a whole AI voice thing for all that. Like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> but all it really is is just them in the server calling you a pedophile because you don't agree with them or they have no idea what's going on. So yeah, um, once I upload this, I'm probably not gonna upload for like two, three days. I'm gonna be just sitting down playing video games because I don't wanna talk about lollies anymore. This topic is so fucking annoying. And I've searched up the word child porn so many fucking times. I wouldn't be surprised if the FBI knocks my door asking me what the fuck is going on. So yeah, subscribe, like my stuff and all that extra jazz and uh, I'll, I'll make some fire banger videos, trust. I just need like two days. I need a break, bro.